At the founding of Bernheim Arboretum and Research Forest in 1929, Isaac Wolf Bernheim insisted Bernheim be available to all people regardless of race, creed, or economic status. We continue to be welcoming and to build relationships with communities and groups beyond our borders. Our conservation efforts protect the diverse habitats for plants and animals, managing our land for biodiversity and resiliency in the landscape. The Backside Learning Center is an independent nonprofit organization located on the backside of Churchill Downs Racetrack, and our mission is to build community and enrich the lives of the equine workers and their families. Bernheim helps us do that by making it possible to connect our families from the backside to the wonders of nature out at Bernheim. This partnership connects our youth to nature by making it possible for them to access big, wild spaces that are not readily available here in the south end of Louisville. So when we went out to Bernheim for summer camp, the kids got to hike all around, they got to walk through creeks, going and playing in the Placo system, they're climbing trees, they're jumping on stumps, they're scrambling up mountains and playing in the sand. The partnership with Bernheim means a great deal to us at the Backside Learning Center. Um, it has afforded us the ability to bring families and youth participants out to the forest um, on a number of occasions, been able to see them, see the wonder light up their eyes as they engage in a space that's completely different to one that they're used to being in. The connection between Bernheim and Nelson County Schools has allowed our students to be exposed to agriculture through a different lens. We are able to utilize Bernheim as a classroom, so we have thousands of acres here on site that we cannot recreate in a high school setting. This is a real world environment with real world challenges and problems. So as our students unite with the professionals here in this place, they're able to think of possibilities and things they can explore and create to address issues here at Bernheim. Nelson County Schools is grateful to Bernheim for this opportunity. Being able to connect with the professionals here has opened the door for many of our teachers and students, and we look forward to being able to continue this partnership for many years to come. Bernheim has been instrumental in helping Bridge Kids International fulfill our mission because we're about using the power of African heritage culture and the development of young people. And through working with Bernheim, we get to do that in nature. We have been so blessed and so lucky to have a partnership with Bernheim um, because it's allowed Bridge Kids International um, to access nature and really program in nature, specifically um, with the Louisville Rites of Passage program and with Seven Generations African Heritage Culture Camp. So we have young people from the age of seven to um, 18 years old um, being able to um, be in nature uh, together and very intentionally through our work with Bernheim. I think our partnership with Bernheim adds an extra layer um, because there are lots of organizations that are doing youth programming um, in the community, but for us to be able to do that like in a space as beautiful as Bernheim and that is partnering with us, you know, so it's not that we're just going out and having a good time and it'll be a memorable day, but we're talking about an ongoing long-term relationship where we can build on the work that we do over time. As a research forest, Bernheim provides quality natural habitats for use in research and education to help improve our understanding of nature and its processes. We continue to partner with scientists from many sectors, including federal, state, university, nonprofit, students, and citizen scientists. This diverse group of researchers facilitates the development of knowledge across a spectrum of education levels and generates outreach materials for Bernheim's diverse audience. The data, the results, and the conclusions that are drawn from this research extends beyond our borders and it helps us to advocate for conservation efforts beyond Bernheim and Kentucky.